So you've got a job in a new city? Well, let's talk about how to make that transition much easier. You know, on those scales that they talk about, about things that are stressful, moving new jobs, even though they can be a lot of fun and there's much adventure, can be very, very stressful. I mean, think about you're moving to a place that you might not be familiar with. Plus, you're starting a new job. You have to find a place to live. All of that can be so overwhelming. But here are a few tips to help you as you transition into your new life and to the new adventure that's ahead of you. The first tip is to plan your move early. The earlier you can do it, the better. So for example, get your movers all set up as soon as you know the date that you can leave. Just that much can do so much to relieve the pressure from all of the other things that you'll be doing to get ready for your move. Another important piece of planning early is to give yourself some time to settle into your new position and your new city. Now, some jobs will give you that in-processing period where they expect that you're going to be in and out as you're getting things together for your new home. But sometimes that's not the case. So plan ahead so that you have some time to get familiar with the area once you arrive. Now, if you're driving, go ahead and start to plan that route. Why? Again, the more you have planned, the fewer surprises you'll have in the end. And while surprises for birthdays or anniversaries can be a lot of fun, they're not as much fun when you're in the middle of a big transition, like moving to a new city and getting a new job. So plan ahead, think about your movers, think about settling in, and think about driving. The second tip is you want to research the area you're going to be going to, where your job is. So look at the neighborhood. Think about your commute. Do you want to live far away and have to commute in? Is it even a possibility to live close to your new job area? Think about the amenities you want to have available to you. Do you want to live in an HOA or do you want to live in an apartment as a transition? The other thing to consider, and this is particularly important for military, is how long do you think you're going to be in the area? That can determine what kind of permanent home you're going to have. Are you going to look to sell your home in the next three to four years? Well, that's going to cause you to create a different set of choices for your home than if you're planning to stay And let's say you don't mind having a bit of a fixer-upper out in the country that you don't care if you sell it or not. These are just some of the research things that you want to be considering and adding into your planning. Keep in mind, things can change and that's okay. The more research you do, the better you're going to feel and the less stress you're going to have and probably build some anticipation about that new place you're going to be living in. Finally, do a little research about the town that you're going to? What are the cool restaurants? What are the hangouts that you would particularly enjoy being at? What about the parks? What attractions are there? I live in Del Rio, Texas, and some people think it's the edge of the United States. To be honest, we are on the border, but we have a lot of interesting places for people to check out. We have a winery that's the oldest winery in the state of Texas nearby. We even have Native American wall paintings that draw visitors from all around the world on an annual basis. Not very far is the famous place for Judge Roy Bean, who was the law of the West. And if that's what's available here in a town like Del Rio, you can only imagine what kind of attractions are in the place you're going to that would be of interest to you that you can explore, particularly as you're getting settled in. You know, moving is stressful, but it doesn't have to be overwhelming. With a little bit of research and a little bit of planning, you can make this move the best move ever. Thank you for watching this video and for liking and sharing with your friends. If you found this content helpful, please subscribe and click the bell so that you get notified when more content just like this is available. Thank you so much. Ciao.